Hey, what's going on guys? This is Missin and welcome to my Blue Eyes combo video. So before you start, friendly reminder to like and subscribe because it motivates me a lot to keep making videos like these. This video is a bomb, by the way. Really, really powerful combo. So without further ado, let's jump right into combo number one. All right, so for combo number one, as you can see, I have Sage with Eyes of Blue with literally any special summon in like the entire existence. And I chose like Garbage Lord because I don't know, I, I just really like garbage cards. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm not talking about like the Sky Striker cards, but like actual like garbage ogre and garbage lord so uh yes yeah, so the first play that i do is stage with eyes of blue search specifically for white stone of ancients finally it's actually going to be doing like something in this combo so the graveyard effect is going to come up i think even the end phase effect but anyways link cross is going to be turned down it like turned into two uh, link tokens. This is something that I want to mention because it was very obvious that I was going into Needle Fiber. However, it is not so obvious that I summon White Stone of Legend. And also, I want to. I want you to know that this combo is 100% brickless. So outside of like actual regular Blue Eyes White Dragon and some like kind of like I mean your engine cards, which I still think they aren't too bad. This combo literally does not play a single brick, no O-Lion, no Jet Synchron, none of that. It's very clean to be honest, so White Stone of Legend is going to search for Blue Eyes, and Formula Synchron is, draw is gonna draw one card. Marshall Marcher is going to revive back that White Stone of Legend, is gonna make LP and then search Blue Eyes. This combo is pretty much the exact same like beginning as Dragon Link, but it's going to get like very cool right now, so yeah, save for it. And uh, not Brotor, because Seyford actually has, like, an effect that you can instantly use in the graveyard, whereas Brotor, it's only when a card, like, you control is destroyed by a battle or by a card effect, so it's a little bit more reactive. Seyford is gonna surge that uh, Levianir, then Levianir is going to banish three lights from your graveyard, and including either Blue Eyes White Dragon or the White Stone of Legend, it doesn't matter which one you, uh, which one you banish, because, yeah, exactly, the, the, the monster that you did banish... Uh, will be brought back with Pisty. So it's kind of like your Levinier only banished two monsters instead of three. It makes it less expensive for your graveyard. Now you're going to make Spirit Dragon, which is going to search that third and final Blue Eyes. And now, okay, this is what I have to explain. If you want to go for a fifth draw in your combo, you can actually like use the like the graveyard effects of Safer to recycle back that Blue Eyes. So when you go for uh, Skull Deet, you draw four cards, you put back the three Blue Eyes on the bottom of your deck, and you just keep the four draws from uh, Skaldeet and the one draw from Formula Synchron, so it's a draw five combo. And you can already see why we have VFD at our disposal right now. But I chose not to do that because I'd rather have a Levineer and four random draws than have five completely random draws because Levineer is just, to be honest, like a significantly better card than pretty much. I mean, it's one of the best cards in your deck. It's uh, a guaranteed follow-up and it's a very like explosive card that you can just use even if you can't use the effect because you can just make like rank 8 monsters. So Cloud Castle is going to revive back the spirit because we can tag out the spirit into a level 7 or 8 or like even a 10 dragon synchro light monster, pretty much any light dragon synchro from your extra deck and it is destroyed during the end phase. However, you can only special summon like it like it doesn't like ignore the summoning condition. So, you do have a limit on what kind of monsters you can summon. So, the level 8 monster is interesting. Start a spark dragon. It, it, it doesn't have to be start a spark. Its effect doesn't even come up. It's just that we need a level 8 non tuner so you can, we can actually sync that start a spark with a level 1 tuner such as the white stone of ancients to make that cloud castle to revive back the spirit dragon and that's how we make like a really easy VFD. And now the Seyfert is going to recycle back the Levineer. I can just keep it in my hand or I can just special summon it. It's uh, it's really up to it's it's up to me. And then during the end phase, we get the White Stone of Ancient special summon. And we yeah, we have like a 3,000, 2,800 2, defense blue eyes. All this was just with two cards. We even have like a blue eyes recycle from our graveyard next turn with um White Stone of Ancient's effect. And then this Levineer is just going to explode because we can banish like three lights again, revive back any monster from our graveyard. We still have three cards in the extra deck. So that was just a very explosive combo, man. It's so easy, like, all that without any O-line shenanigans, no Orada, no nothing. It's just very natural, like, it's basically just dragon cards outside of, like, Needle Fiber, Link Cross, and... Yeah, literally everything else is just, like, cards that you would probably play in your Blue Eyes deck anyway, so it doesn't really add any weaknesses to your deck. It just makes your deck better when you want it to be stronger. It just adds some ceiling. And if you want to play like super conservative, whether you can just play it like a control play style with like spirit and hand traps. But this deck does have the ability to play 12 to 15 hand traps, which is just absolutely ridiculous. So let's jump into combo number two, which isn't really a combo number two. I'm just going to be talking about like variations of the combo. But it is very important for you to stay until the very end so you can actually... Uh, learn how to play this deck inside and out, like regardless of what hand you have. So let's jump right into it. 
All right, so this hand, I think, I don't know if this is the hand where I drew kind of awkward, but anyways, I go emergency teleport to summon that ogre because as I stated, literally just needle fiber alone does the eggs, like the full combo. So we literally normal summon Valor, like when's the last time you saw someone go Italy summon ogre and then normal Valor and proceed to make like 25 billion negates. It's gonna be ridiculous, man. Just needle fiber starts your blue eyes engine, like that's just crazy, man. White stone of legends, just being able to search like 10 times per turn. Man, that that that's just some that's just some feels feels nice to be honest. <laughs> so yeah, Whitestone of Legend is going to be brought back again. Oh my god, we I should actually have it like a a counter for how many blue eyes white dragon searches I've made in this video. Like someone in the comments definitely um tr try to keep track. Honestly, this is just ridiculous. And yeah, once again, the safer literally free Lavinia bringing back Whitestone of Legends and then bring back the blue eyes. Okay, now we have our three blue eyes access because unfortunately I hard drew one of the blue eyes. So I shouldn't go spirit first. I should make spirit after mulliganing those uh, blue eyes white dragon on the bottom of the deck. So this is exactly what we're going to do, right? We want to keep the blue eyes on the field and the white stone of legend so we can make blue eyes uh, spirit or whatever the name is. So we're just going to make skull deed using these four. Alrighty, so draw four cards. Oh my god, we can turn like anything into hand shops. Like, imagine if you're like post game one and you put in like a pointer of the Red Lotus, Imperial Order, Royal Decree, Skill Drain, ridiculous cards like that. You're like, you're always gonna draw them because you're digging your deck like there is no tomorrow. And the draws literally are free because Blue Eyes Red Dragon is way too easy to search. So literally every time you see Whitestone of Legends searching a Blue Eyes White Dragon, in your head you can kind of just consider it as a draw one card from your deck. It's basically that. And then uh, yeah, Blue Eyes Alternative is going to uh, special summon itself, we're gonna make v uh, VFD. By the way, this- <laughs> exactly, yeah, this is what I wanted to say. Sometimes you have like this, like you're um, you're at this point where you have no more special summons in your hand, but you have uh, Sage with one level 8 monster and you're like, mm, I want to make one extra rank 8. Well, guess what? You can because you can just trade in your like your skull deed for, level, for uh, blue eyes from your uh, deck. Um, and then that's it. Like you have even a Levianir as a follow-up. So you have Harbinger, VFD, three hand shops, a really lethal, very aggressive follow-up for next turn. And man, that's just I I just love this so much. And you still have like two more like slots in your extra deck, so you can pretty much like do anything you want at this point. Let's jump into replay number three or combo number three. Alright, so we have emergency teleport yet again because this card is nasty. And we have Sage of Thalia's Blue. Once again, though, unfortunate that we had to hard draw a blue eyes white dragon again because it is such like such an easy card to search that you never want to draw it unless like i mean the situation is really weird because you hard draw like blue eyes alternative as well or you have like melody and you want to search like alternative and stuff this is all the bad luck in the planet my formula synchron draws me a blue eyes because i cannot go chain link one formula chain link two white stone of legend since white stone of legend is a mandatory effect it will always be in chain link one and formula synchron which is a, like an optional effect has to be an at least chain link two or higher so that's just man that's just so unlucky now i have to you know let, yeah you see now i'm linking off like the the white stone of legend and i'm not getting a surge because my draw was just wasted on a blue eyes so it's it's unfortunate, but we're still going to be ending on like the nuts. Even though we like we drew two useless cards, right? We drew like a blue eyes in our opening hand. We drew into a blue eyes with uh, Fimola Synchron. So now we're mulliganing everything back. So up on like now we're you see now we're getting our searches again, and now uh, trade in pitch blue eyes, trade in pitch Bigfoot. The draw power is stupid. You can borderline deck out. And, like, you don't even mill in this deck. If you can make the Chaos Ruler Demonic Dragon, that card's nuts, by the way. Uh, I should probably, probably make, like, an updated version of Blue Eyes with the Chaos Ruler Demonic. But yeah, look at, look at, look at this board. Again, like, I just feel like this is so consistent. Infinite Ogre, Valor, VFD, double Levianir in hand, double Danger, literally six in hand with, like, a really oppressive board. Like, this is... Uh, four interruptions and we kill our opponent 100% guaranteed next turn and we have white stone of ancients which i believe can recycle back alternative okay no it can't but it can still recycle back blue eyes next turn we draw it like oh my god that's that's just nuts like we have like 10 billion cards in our hand oh my god how do you lose with this deck it's just so good i honestly believe that this deck is tier one but let's jump into combo number four yeah i, I mean combo slash replay it's basically the same but 
Once again, we hard draw Blue Eyes White Dragon. It's annoying, right? <laughs> but yes, uh, Orochimaru is going to discard Ghost Ogre, so we have to normal summon the Ash and make Needle Fiber do as if nothing ever happened. That trade in is going to be very good later on. Uh, you shouldn't use trade in at the very beginning of the combo because you might draw into that Safe Word and Blue Eyes, which are they're not Garnets, but they're Takatom Borgs. This deck does not play a single Garnet, regardless of what you draw, as long as you have Needle Fiber uh, combo, you are 100% guaranteed of making VF at least so that, that's just insane and draw like four four cards <laughs> so yeah yeah you're going to do like a lot of things yeah that's just that's just nasty man come on like oh my god just look at all of those pluses it's cr crazy pisty levianir re revive back the white stone special summon back blue eyes you know it's you're gonna get used to it honestly so once again, let's just look at our, our hand. Like, we go from, like, three cards, including two blue eyes, to, like, ten billion cards with, like, only live cards. And now uh, we can tag out this blue eye spirit since we have our level one tuner access. Uh, cloud, uh, cloud Castle or the Gigantic Castle? I always get mixed up. Oh, my God. But yeah, search blue eyes, make a VFD. And then I think I'm going to risk it with the Bigfoot. I forgot. I think I'm going to risk it now. Yes. Because I'm like, oh, whatever. I have so many hand shops. I, I don't care. Ashe, I guess, is the only one that really matters, but I don't really care. As long as I can summon Bigfoot, I know I have a rank 8 access. And yeah, that, even that Thunder, Thunderbird. Um. So now I'm going to make Zombie Stein, and I'm going to turn these two into a Heretic Seal. So three, five, six interruptions. Ridiculous. <laughs> Just ridiculous. Heretic Seal, Zombie Stein, it can negate any monster spell or trap by detaching like one material, sending one card from your hand to the graveyard, and uh, putting Zombie Stein in defense, so I cannot put Zombie Stein in attack. It has to be swapped into defense, and besides it has like a thousand defense, so you can easily jump. I mean, you can't jump over because VFD prevents my opponent from attacking, and yeah, th this is just like ridiculous. <laughs> I really, really don't know how you lose, even if you get Dark Rulered or Sphere Mode, uh, like this floats, and then you have three hand shops. So it it's just like... I don't know, like you plus so much that literally nothing matters. And as long as you have that Levineer follow up, which is very easy to do because Safe Fruit inherently in the combo gets you that Levineer like recursion back from your graveyard to your hand, you always have like a really good uh, turn three. So let's jump into the next uh, combo slash replay. <laughs> this is funny. I swear to God. And this, this, you're going to see this quite often. But I literally have Bigfoot and four hand traps. Two of them are. Uh, identical so it's redundant but if you're going second like you're destroying your opponent by the way like it's hand shop hand shop hand shop and then full combo <laughs> so bigfoot is going to not get sniped oh my god thank the lord it doesn't matter what i draw but i drew white stone of legend which seriously i could have played without it because needle fiber summons white stone anyways so what does it really change it only all it does is special summon white stone of ancient so i can recur back a blue eyes from your, my graveyard to my hand but honestly, I could have lived without it. So just bla like Bigfoot and four hand shops gets you there. It's just hilarious, especially when you're talking about blue eyes, right? Like when's the last time, you know, that was a combo. Like l the last time blue eyes was really explosive is when my boy Massey um, thought out thought of like a combo that involved like Dark Matter Dragon pitching like a lot of cards and then you would pretty much end on like le legit six negates. But yeah, it's it's crazy. And by the way, that that Levy near sometimes can actually... Uh, Go for the triple dark so you can like remove a card from your opponent's hand it's just that if you do that you're going to be needing one extra level one summon so it's a bit harder anyways that safer is or or, or like a level eight like alternative for example so yeah safer is going to search levineer revive back blah 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 all those plays are always the same very very repetitive now we're going to make spirit before the skull deed because we really want to have that blue eyes that we can mulligan back and now, yeah, you see, this is the part where you re like recur back the blue eyes red dragon. So if you go skull deep and you draw four, you put back all three blue eyes and you get to keep four for uh, your four draws. So you have Ash, Valor, Ogre, uh, Tsuchinoko, and four random draws. So seven cards in hand. Yes, and already a spirit dragon. So and now we drew our level one monster. Uh, that I mean, so the thing is, we don't have to special summon effect Valor. If we didn't draw this, it w it still would have been VFD because we just special special summon Valor with Skaldit. So we'll tag out into start a spark and then Cloud Castle, search Blue Eyes Red Dragon, and then revive back Dragon Spirit of White. Uh, make VFD. So, god, oh my god, Blue Eyes alternative, and then Bigfoot. Discard the Blue Eyes because I'm good at Yu-Gi-Oh. 
uh, this with the, like the Tsuchinoko was kind of like unnecessary. I was just like, can I draw into like a level eight extender again? But uh, nah, I, I my my luck ran out. I just drew a trade in that technically I can use if I want to discard the Levinier, but. Mm -mm. I'd rather just keep Lavinia as a follow-up, uh, but but I don't. <laughs> I just I, I just uh, use it to make like Heretic Seal with a Zombie Stein. So even if, by the way, even if I didn't have uh, the freaking thingy, the Lavinia like recursion, I could have went like used VFD's effect on my own turn called Dark, and then like alternative becomes Dark. Bigfoot is already Dark, so I make Zombie Stein that way. So I am 100% covered from Evenly, but uh, I, I feel like Evenly is not even that big of a deal. You can just go like Heretic Seal, bounce back your own card, and then special summon like on the resolution and stuff like that. So uh, that's it for this combo slash replay. Let's jump into, I believe, what should be the f final one. Final replay of Blue Eyes, indeed. So, man, Blue Eyes combo is seriously a deck to be like, it's just a force to be reckoned with, honestly. This deck is very, very good. Ridiculously consistent because just Needle Fiber alone gets you there. Obviously, if you play Jet Synchron and stuff, you can do the combo just with one card, but eh, that's just lame, honestly. We're not playing Jet Synchron, we're playing Sage with Eyes of Blue because we're cool. <laughs> so, Banana is going to get your two tokens. I shouldn't have to just, like, explain any of that it's just kind of obvious to this point at this point i do not draw safer or blue eyes which are the two cards that you don't want to draw with formula like ever 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 <laughs> so marshall marcher is going to revive back lp search your second blue eyes i think i don't have a blue eyes in the graveyard right oh no i do i do i do so if i can get that white stone of ancients i can recycle it back and then when i draw with skull deed that's it's gonna be sick because i'll be able to put back all three blue eyes but unfortunately that's not the case so yeah, kind of, kind of unfortunate, but it's it's not too bad. You can still do like so much. You you see, like White Stone of Ancients, it get gets me that uh, second blue eyes. So even if I don't have like everything, it's it's all good. But back to blue eyes, that that upstart man, it could be nice. Could be nice. I, is it nice? Yes. It draws me an Ash, which is an interruption I, that I don't have. But what the heck, man? Yo, that feeling when special summoning Valor allows you to make VFD. Yeah, it's just nasty, man. Spirit VFD. What the heck? <laughs> what? Oh my god. This is like super overkill, by the way. Like, you literally don't have to do that, but... Bro, uh, how am I supposed to lose? Like... What? VFD? Zombie Stein? Ogre? Double Infinite? Ash? Uh, what? <laughs> That's nuts. <laughs> it's broken. This deck is insane. Once again, no breaks. Like, no O-Lion, no nothing. It's just... Your Needle Fiber Special Summon is just White Stone of Legends, like that's it. And you don't even need to like make Needle Fiber in like a fancy way, you don't even need discards, you don't play Romulus, you don't have like like a brick like Dragon Ravine that you can draw and then like make a Romulus that doesn't search anything. This deck is just very very clean, it can go second super super well, so yeah, that's pretty much all I had to say and showcase for this beautiful Blue Eyes combo video. If you guys have any comments or feedback, let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe because it motivates me a lot to keep making videos like these. That's pretty much it. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.